Hey friends, welcome back to Pastor Kevin and Friends, and look who's back. What do we do to get him out? What? Yeah, that's right, we have to call him. So everybody on the count of three. One, two, three. What do we say? We say, hey, Platty. So ready? One, two, three. Platty! I don't know if he's going to come out yet today or not. But, but, try again. Platty! I don't know if he's coming out today. We're going to have to work on this a little hard. One more time. One, two, three. Platty! Oh, there you are. Hey, welcome back, Platty. Are you doing okay? You're not. What's wrong? You bumped your beak and it hurt? What? Oh, you need me to pray for you? Why, why do I need to pray for you? Oh, because you had a bad dream and you don't think you're going to be going to heaven because of your bad dream? Oh, in your dream you went to hell? That doesn't sound fun. Well, you was scary? Well, wait, wait, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. You don't think you know Jesus is your forever friend anymore? No, 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 no. Wait a minute, Flatty, Flatty. That, that's wrong. You don't need to that. For, let me ask you a question. Do you believe that Jesus is Lord? Do you believe that God raised him from the dead? So the Bible tells us that if we believe in our hearts, yes, your heart, that uh, Jesus is Lord, and you believe that, and that God raised him from the dead, you believe that, then we shall be saved, that we shall be made right with Jesus. That is good news, but you're having troubles with it? Well, hey, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's, I, I think I know what the problem is. You have a D. No, yes, I know you have good grades in school, but there's a D in your life. Oh, a D, the D is called doubt. And the enemy, Satan, likes to put that into our lives so that we will not know that Jesus loves us. Yes, that's bad, but there's a way to get rid of it. You want to know how to get rid of it? Well, the Bible tells us in Mark eleven twenty three that if we speak to a mountain or our problem in faith and we don't doubt in our heart, it's going to be done for us. And what we need is God's word in our doubt and it's going to go away. Well, that, that's what we need to do. So we need to speak the truth. We need to speak what God's word is truth. So we need to speak and believe because our faith is going to get rid of the doubt. Well, when the doubt tries to come back, we need to speak God's word into it. So what we need to do is speak the word. Mark eleven twenty three, and all your doubts will flee. Yes, that does right. Mark eleven twenty three, and all your doubts will flee. So we need to believe that Jesus is Lord and that God raised him from the dead, which shall be saved. But we also can speak to our problems. Yes, we tell them, go away, because God has said, and God is bigger than anything. Oh, yeah, it's time for you to go. All right. Hey, friends, we'll see you real soon. And this is Platy and me saying bye-bye.